Change, which is the organization that helped put uh, together today's event. So, welcome guys. It is a pleasure to have you here. Um, mine is to say to you guys, really, uh, having you here today is, 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 is really a milestone for what we are trying to do. Um, I'm not going to speak much, there is um, a gentleman who's, who is going to come and introduce the purpose for this day, who we are, what we stand for and what we are trying to do. Uh, Mr. Tokozai Nimakaveni who is going to come and welcome you all. Um, can we give him a hand please? I'm really excited and I think uh, everyone who's here today is very excited to see the crowd today. And we really hope that you will enjoy yourself and you will benefit from the conversation that we've been having today. The, the, the theme is creating entrepreneurs prospering South Africa. The reason we have this theme is because we believe that entrepreneurship uh, is the way South Africa should be going moving forward. We receive sponsorship from various organizations. We are moving change. Uh, we partnered with the Innovation Hub. We have KPMG. We also have uh, the uh, youth content, uh, the team, uh, the business team for youth uh, content speaking uh, later on today. We also have uh, the poll marketing. We really want to appreciate the poll marketing because we can always see people in the crowd. These workshops and seminars that we put together will really target you again. We want to make sure that you spread out to the rest of the country. Thank you, Dr. Rani. Thank you for having me here. It's just such an absolute pleasure. But you have given me a very difficult task. When I look around this room and I hear from you how brilliant these kids are, you're telling me that we should tell them to become entrepreneurs, which I agree with you. But a part of me is saying, oh, I'd love to have all of you at KPMG with me. <laughs> so now I'm going to tell you to be entrepreneurs, I can't work with KPMG, but I'll try and keep my personal interests aside there. Africa is the last frontier of growth. There is no more exciting region of the world than Africa in which to grow. So really what I want to do today is talk to you about three, three stories, I suppose. Uh, only two of which I know something about, not a lot. And the third, you know the most about, because the third is your journey. So the two journeys I want to tell you about is our journey, KBMG. Why are we looking at Africa? Why do we think that Africa has a lot of potential? And why we feel so envious of people like you who have your whole life ahead of you to serve and to succeed in this beautiful continent. The second is their journey. I want to tell you about some of the African entrepreneurs that we work with, many that you would have heard of yourself. And I really wanted to share some of these lessons which you may already know of, but it's always nice to hear from people who've been there and done it. So I'll share with you some of their stories. So now, when you have the credibility, when you have the business plan that is going to print money, how do you that? approach the right people to find your business plan. So we'll um, uh, welcome uh, Mr. Seho to the stage and he will um, explain how to then fund your business plan and how to give access to funding for your venture. To just, you know, give you an idea of, you know, what then, when that great idea is there, what Roy Tesh spoke about, you know, some of the biggest stumbling blocks and the context in South Africa is that, we don't have the money to finance our ideas and to give them that life to go forward. So what I'm hoping to do today is just you know, give you an overview, getting you an opportunity to start to understand what the various sources of finance are for new businesses in South Africa. Also get, giving you a small understanding, a basic understanding of um, how to distinguish or differentiate between various sources of finance and also to, we're gonna start putting it in the South African landscape and see, you know, how do people finance their entrepreneurial ideas and their businesses within South Africa. 